Actually, I bring the video for a firefighting layout how to scroll to the fire sprinklers in this system. We are using this is office area totally. So we using a uh, here here uh, pendant types. So you can see upright we are using or usually in the parking area where is no ceiling. So this is ceiling area with the pendant types. So I will show you this is layout for firefighting to the whole plan. So in the project. So I will start here. This is a shaft, a big shaft. This is shaft is coming from here. This is steel room arrow thing here. This is a shaft. This main shaft is being cut in here. So you can see here. This is two upper floor. This pipe is going to the lower upper floor. And uh, this is a 150 fire water riser. This is here. This is and this is 50 dia uh, DPR. Uh, DPR means you know say this is a drain pipe riser if you want to drain the water by the slope so this is here okay. so the start is from here this is 150 by here this is uh, FC, FCVA this is here so this is basically we saying to the pair one packages or this is a zone control valve we already made the video for zone control valve you can see the detail of the control valve so this is your control valve we saying the FCVA for ventilations so this is a pipe going here this is a small pipe is coming here for for here you can see here this is main pipe 150 dia this is going to the here here this is the main two pipes so main two pipes so here we have a distribution for firefighting water we start from here this is 25 this is basically this this is upright sprinklers uh, Sorry, pendant type sprinklers we using here. This is this is all the firefighting. So we used to provide a fire uh, fire sprinklers, fire sprinkler here. Basically here to here the dimension should be three meter, and here to here the dimension should be four meters. We have to distribute the pipe like three by four because in NFPA uh, we need twelve point three, NFPA thirteen we need twelve point three. One sprinkler should be covered. So this is a wall here. So this is this is the main pipe is going to connect this and after that white line so we provide to the here to here four meter and three meters so it means you have to calculate here three by four three by four, 12, 12 square meters so as per NFPA we need the 12.3 square meters so first will be one inch or 25 mm second will be same like that second same like that sprinkler will come and third sprinkler will be a 32 this is a spot by NFP this is only one sprinkler is going here this is 25 yeah. so this is a main line and this is a riser going up and then this will be 5 will be connect with this one this is going to the 40 because we need 32 here and 25 here so we are provided provide a, this pipe size is a 40 so 150 pipe is as a loop so going here 32 25 25 so i will be clear one once again this will be 3 meter and this will be 20 this will be 4 meter so as per you see here we distributed here 4 meter 4 meter 4 meter 3 meter 3 meter 3 meter 3 meter 3 meter 3 meter so if you are calculate here so one speaker cover 12 3 3 into 12 3, 3 into 4 is a 12 square meter so NFPA need a 12.3 so we're distributing here see here like that in whole area see going here this is same like that one sprinkler should be 25 25 and 32 should be 32 this one this is 25 25 and 25 150 and then the riser going up and connect here so this is here see here see here this is white line is main line this 52 inch pipe is going for a firehouse cabinets this is firehouse cabinet here firehouse cabinet i already made a video for this one basically firehouse cabinet we are uh, we are we are using in every floor this is the firehouse cabinet there is a cabinet inside we keep the hair on a cylinder and there is a, also is a uh, pipe hose this is maximum 30 meter pipe hose we can use here as per NFP so this is explaining you this one firefighting this is 2 inch 
not to get you see this is going to over here riser going up first here riser coming up here and they going to one inch here and this is we have one two three sprinklers so two sprinklers will be covered with the 25 and third will be will be 32 this is a spare NFPA so this is distributing here like that so distributing here like that so this is distributing here so this is the uh, spectral test wall we have to provide a test wall for here for example the leakage test or uh, pressure test we have to provide to the gauges here to see here for example we are going to the spec at the all pipe leakage leakage test or pressure test so should be it will be come to the minimum 12 so, uh, 12 bar or you say the operating of op, whatever the operating here 1.5 1.5 more than 1.5 for example we have here so we have to go to 1.5 1.5 is with the 10 10 bar 10.5 bar 7 bar we have pressure usually in this uh, in this uh, firefighting system so 10.5 like that but we are usually usually, usually we using a, a pressure test in 12 bars so we have to provide the gauge we will see after 24 hours the pressure we have, we have to put the water uh, by the pumping here by the motorized or by the manually and after that gauge will be come to the 12 bar so after that we have to lock this one seal this one with the tape and signature and then after that we will become after 24 hours and check that this uh, the gauge is still showing a 24 sorry it's still showing a 12 bar so it's mean it's okay or if the little bit of pressure crop it's been some somewhere is a little bit leakage so we have to reject this one and then we have to redo so conductor will be due to this one so this is sprinkler so this is for example i will explain you here see here how much the sprinkler this is here this is service lobby 25 two sprinkler 25 i told you three sprinklers as, as well 24 25 up to 25 here and then 32 32, 32 will be contained only the one sprinkler so after that this will be the 40 from here to here 40 a pipe dia and this is only one sprinkler going here the 25 so we distributing as a 40 32 25 25 so this is our standard you can see in google the standard or the distribution of the pipe this is a main pipe loop pipe this is a firehouse cabinet is going here so we're distributing all the pipe system like that so you can see here this is before is coming to the 150 we reduce the pipe size here as well here because uh, as per the calculation we need 100 only so 100 pipe dia of range you say this is this is a riser and if you go riser then it will be go like that so i already explained in the examples so you can see here this is distributing a sprinkler here as well this is 32 32 25 25 25 this is 100 this is 25 25 25 i told you this is will be 4 meter and this will be 3 meter because we need as per nfpa 12 square meter so 12 square meters 12.3 square meter so nfpa 13 so we have to distribute the sprinkler sprinkler basically is when the sprinkler explode you know so they will be make the water like that for example this will explode here so it will be covered this area like that and make the uh, circle like that this one and this will be circle will be covered like that and this circle will be covered so this all circle will be covered the all the area as per nfpa this one see here as a like that circle make the water and make the water circle like that so hope you are enjoying and you are understanding that this video and uh, this is distributing in all this left of the area this is this is this is showing here this is far body and this is main pipe is going like that distribution is so simple this is for example 25 25 here 25 25 32 40 40 and 25 because two sprinkler will be covered by the 25 and third will be the 32 okay and uh, 32 only contain to the one sprinklers and after that is 40 40 contain the two 
and after O3 will be we will be the we have to go to the 50. So no need 50 here because this is only we will be putting other points. So this is a riser going up. This is we did use a dia as well. 100 after 75 because this dia is going uh, there in this five is going to the end here. 25.25 see here. This is 25.25. This is 25.25. 25. This is 25, 25, 25, 22, 50. This is main pipe is still now. 25, 25. So this is the finish here. We can finish here with the head like that. Still, it is 25, 25, 32, 30. This is see here. I will explain here. This is 25, two, two spin clip cover 25. And third will be the 32. Fourth will be the 40 and fourth fifth will be the 50 i told you and six will be the 63 so we're distributing as per nfps uh, pipe distribution in the spin class 225 uh, 132 one uh, two four two forty okay and 150 and one is the 63 you can see in the chat uh, uh, chart available in the uh, internet you can see this distribution of the property so this is all will be the uh, uh, all will be the uh, pen uh, pendant type because this is all the ceiling area so we're providing here so as you can see here so you can see here we have come and we will come here this is a main riser this is a main riser for drain pipe we have to drain the pipe here so this is pipe is coming here on two pipes so here one pipe is for drying, one pipe is for distribution. So it will be a uh, slope. We keep the slope in all the hair. This is zone control valve. In zone control valve, there will drain here. We can see the drain. Drain will be put to the down, down to the this in ground floor. Up to the ground floor, there is also in ground floor available. The flow drain. So we will use flow in the flow drain. We have to drain the water. Uh, when we drain the water during of the leakage test we have to drain the water and the pH level of water is not retained we are checking here with the chemical testing are not retained we have to remove the water and keep the water new so this is for maintenance purpose we need uh, to drain the water so hope you enjoy this video and you understand the functions of the, this fire, uh, fire, uh, fire sprinkler and firefighting system so hope uh, kindly prescribe my channel if you did not prescribe so i will make the more video for you thank you bye bye friendly